ka india mongolia joint military exercise nomadic elephant kalasdang nigasngi ha ka foreign training note ha umroi mikhalia yagne ka exercise ka bakarpang jongkini ki arkan hun ki sipai kansdang nadu ka laitrik hadu ka khan rutrik jong july ar hajar ar psao ha ka ba nakalyang jongki kanhun sipai na kari india ki don kumba south sangut ha ka ba lamikma da ka battalion of sikkim scot rangkat bat ki kanhun jong ki sipai ha ki benda ki baper baper nangta na ka nap mongolian contingent la shimenta da shispa san phongot reaction force battalion jong ka mongolian army Firstly, Sam Bethsanu and uh, to my friends from the first, second scouts, Sapaiko Miro Ram Ram. It is with great pleasure that I extend a warm welcome to His Excellency and both the contingents of both our countries. Uh, the Umroi military station is nestled in the northern foothills of Shillong. Since 2006, this exercise, Nomadic Elephant, has been a monumental endeavor showcasing the strength of joint training, military exchanges, and shared learning. It marks a significant milestone in our bilateral relationships, highlighting the enduring partnership between Mongolia and India. This is the 16th edition of Exercise Nomadic Elephant, and it bears a true testament to the values of both our countries and the armies of both countries. I am sure that in the intensity of this training, each of you will stand shoulder to shoulder, learning from each other and imparting knowledge to each other. This joint training mode in Umroi, which has been created, actually is the best that we have in the country in terms of uh, the state-of-the-art infrastructure, as well as the area in terms of the sheer land mass required for training bodies of troops. I am sure that both the contingents will utilize it effectively. I'm sanguine as the exercise progresses, the camaraderie and the collaboration across the troops of both the countries will be fostered and there will be a greater sense of unity, shared purpose between our soldiers and officers. In conclusion, I wish to extend my warmest regards to His Excellency Gambol Dambajev, the Ambassador of Mongolia to India and the officers and men of the Mongolian contingent as well as the officers and men of the first second scouts who have come here to conduct this training and i wish both the contingents all the very best uh, as they say amjit husi in uh, mongolian i hope my pronunciations are correct thank you Ambassador. general prasanna joshi general officer commanding 51 Saveria, esteemed guests and the contingent members of both india and mongolia to the 16th edition of the exercise nomadic elephant the exercise will be conducted at the Joint Training Node Umroi for a duration of 14 days commencing today and culminating on the 16th of July 2024. Nestled within a meticulously secured compound, the Joint Training Node at Umroi serves as a premier destination for training. At the core of the facility's allure lies its avant-grade infrastructure such as battle obstacle course, natural rock craft area, jungle lane, sniper, and reflex firing ranges. This joint exercise will provide an opportunity for both Indian and Mongolian armies to train and operate jointly in subconventional operations under Chapter 7 of the United Nations Charter. I take this opportunity to thank the governments of our two nations for taking the initiative of bringing us together. I am sanguine in my hope that this exercise reflects the vibrancy of the Indo-Mongolian relationship. I now invite the contingent commander of the Indian Army, Colonel S.P. Manoli, to welcome the contingents to the exercise Nomadic Elephant and share your thoughts with us. Uh, strategic partnership, which brings us very good physical foundation for developing our bilateral, not only in the political, economic, but also in the military, as well as culture, history, and education, as well as medicine. In case of the nomadic elephant, it was uh, started in 2006, and uh, I personally believe it brings our two 
nation, not only on the military, but also on the spiritual level closer. In case of Mongolia, it provides an uh, opportunity for our military service to strengthen its defense cooperation amidst the common security challenges, not only in our region, but all around the globe. As for our Indian friends, the exercise offers an opportunity to both